forgot that this is literally so zoomed in when I actually press record. <sighs> hey guys, what's up? It's Emily. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I'm going to be doing a little chit chat. Get ready with me because I haven't been on here for a hot second and I'm sorry about that. But a lot of stuff has been going on in my life and I'm about to spill the tea for all y'all. So let's just get on to the video. If you want to see how I transform from looking like this. To looking semi-presentable. Keep on watching. <laughs> I'm just going to keep that intro because do I care about my life? No, I'm not filming it again. So, you're welcome. I could not do my makeup without... I hate... Okay, I love these tops. They're mad cute, but I hate this. Like, these little... What are they called? I don't even know. Little arm fat. I don't like it. So, now I look semi-crazy, as I always do. Um, let's beat the space. I rearranged all my makeup, so this is gonna be interesting because I have no idea where anything is. So, basically, let's start off with the obvious. Um, I moved. Um, it's been sister crazy, kind of, um, come on, say these interesting to say the least. Um, wait, this is not even what I use. Oh my god, see, look at that. I haven't also, I haven't done my makeup literally since like picture day for my senior yearbook which was in June. So, this is gonna be... Quite the adventure. Um, also, if you're wondering, Emily, girl, that hair, what's happening? What's happening? Um, I'm dyeing my hair in like T minus an hour. So, we're just gonna rock with it. And I'm gonna be filming that too, so <laughs> stay tuned. But I'm probably going to uh, post this first because it's quite easy to edit. Because, you know. Anyway. So, yeah. I moved. Uh, I moved in with my uncle and my little cousin and my aunt. So, I'm living with them now. And it's honestly been really fun and really fresh because I am an only child. If y'all did not know. I feel like this is just going to be a horrible video. And I'm so sorry. But, like, it is what it is, you know. Subscribe. <laughs> But it's actually been really fun because I am an only child, so it's been different living with, like, having a big family. Like, usually, literally, it's been, like, all the videos I filmed before, that whole time it was just me and my mom, like, living. So, well, well duh, duh. Living. but, you know, just us living together. So now that I'm actually living with, like, my aunt and my uncle and my little cousin, like, there's three plus two is five. <laughs> There's five of us living in a house, and it's kind of fun. I feel like a full house, like, you know? Oh, my God, I love that show. Full house was the best show, period. I said what I said. Don't fight me. <laughs> But, yeah. But let's talk about my summer, okay? Because my summer's been a little not hot girl summer at all, okay? But, you know, I'm probably going to title this video How to Be, How to Have a Hot Girl Summer, you know? But it hasn't been a hot girl summer at all for me. I have been working because, you know, that's what us adults... No, I'm not a freaking adult. That's what us semi, not really grown people do. Um, my job is interesting. It's my first job ever, so... And no one better be like, hey, you should just spoil back now. But just like, literally, I've never had the time to work in the summer. So, and I go off to college next, I go off to college in like, how am I, eight months? So I have, oh, I was a little aggressive. Sorry. Um, oh, that's fun and fresh. Where's my concealer? <laughs> oh, my God. Ugh. See, that's the other thing. I have no idea where I put all my stuff. If y'all saw where my... Oh, I found it. <laughs> um, if y'all saw where my makeup was, you'd be like, wow. Sad. But... <clears throat> mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Excuse me. But basically, let's just talk about some of the things I've done. So I've been working, you know, been making that bread. Been getting that direct deposit. Waking up every Friday and seeing my little... Go up. Um... But yeah, I've been working. I went to Puerto Rico to visit some family for the first time. It's the first time I've ever been to Puerto Rico. And girl, PR is like it. Like that's where it is. Because wow, like the beaches. Where's the brush? Oh my god, I'll find it. 
<laughs> I'm so impatient. Like, I don't find it in 2.5 seconds, and I'm like, where is it? But, but PR is so nice, and I got to see so much, uh, so many members of my family that I've never met before. So it was really nice, and I definitely want to go back, but I definitely want to do, like, a girl's trip. Like, I'm trying to plan something where, like, me and all my friends go because, ladies, getting turned up in Puerto Rico. That's the, and the men, oh my god. Oh my god, Puerto Rican boys, hello. Sorry, <laughs> I'm so disgusting. But literally, like, wow, I was shook, I was shocked, I was just living my best life. Then from there, I went, so that trip was with my dad, and then I went to Miami with my mama, because, ew, I just gagged the way I said that, um, to visit school's in Miami because that's where I want to go to college lord willing I'll get accepted um but yeah I went to visit colleges and girl I found my college like I was really nervous like if anyone else is out there and struggling with that you'll find the college that you're meant to go to okay like it's really scary like when you're in senior year and everyone's like asking you yo what you want to do like basically making your whole figure out your the rest of your life at the age of 17 like that's not gonna work for me or for anyone so yeah oh no i just made my forehead look bigger let's just keep you down here but i went and i saw these schools and i literally found the one that i literally am obsessed with and we also went um like to look at houses because my mom wants to move down there as well and like i feel like when i'm in miami i'm gonna be living a hot girl life okay not just hot girl summer i'm gonna be living a hot girl life period Period. 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 Nothing left to say, like, period. 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 I'm so excited. I'm going back in, like, a week, which I'm going to be vlogging. I didn't vlog any of these trips, and that's because, first, for Puerto Rico, I brought my freaking camera, but I didn't bring my freaking battery. So, dum-dum. Uh, not fun. But... And then Miami, I was like, I don't really know what to film because, like, we were again looking at schools. Like, I'm not going to walk around, like, walk into a school and, like, hold a camera and be like, <laughs> smile. Kitty girl. I think I'm going to do just, like, a little brown in my crease. I don't really know. I'm going to keep it simple. I want to do, like, my face really glowy. Also, guys, I also, the reason I have not been wearing makeup is because my skin has been bomb AF, if I can say so myself. Like, I am so surprised at how good my freaking skin has been this summer. Like, it really has just blessed my soul. Hashtag blessed. I look so bad. But I dyed my hair. You probably can't even really tell the difference, but I dyed my hair. So, skin -eye. So I think I might do a skincare routine because I don't use, I got Curology. Okay, here's the actual motherfucking tea, okay? I got Curology. I spent my $5 on that little free thing that the Dolan Twins posted because you know I'm not about to spend God knows how much on an actual bottle. No, like almost $30 for two months. I mean, it's not that bad, but like, eh. Anyway, I bought Curology, got it in the mail. I've been trying it out for a hot second and it's done nothing. So, not about to spend my, I canceled it, like, ASAP, because I'm just not, I'm just not going to do that. I'm not going to do that. But I, everything that I use is drugstore. It's, like, $5 for everything. So, I really want to do a skincare routine so y'all can be on that glowy glow. That's so disgusting. I hate myself. Um, for the rest of the school year. But I might, but the, also the other thing is, I feel like Curology, it depends on your acne, actually. I shouldn't talk so bad. Like, if you have, like, mild acne, like, just, like, a couple red dots here and there, like, you know, then get Curology, because I feel like that would work for you. I have really bad hormonal acne, so whenever I'm going to get my period, I break out, and I break out bad okay honestly it actually hasn't been horrible but like see i have a pimple right here i break out a lot here when i have one of my periods so that's what i've been trying to get rid of so i think i might go back to the dermatologist to, just to get like this little spot cream that she gave me once and it worked really really good and i think that's about it like i'm not gonna go crazy about it because <laughs> i don't really care that much <laughs> yeah i'm just doing like minimal eye makeup because I'm literally, girl, I shouldn't even do any eye makeup because I'm going to be filming, okay, wow, <laughs> the New Yorker just jumped out and said boo, but, um, 
I'm gonna be filming. I'm literally dyeing my hair, and I'm gonna have to take a shower to like wash out the dye. So like, I'm gonna take all this off in like two seconds. Like, is there water on this? Ew, what is that? That's gross. And another thing is, I've been trying to like practice my Spanish because if y'all did not know, I'm Dominican, Cuban, and Puerto Rican. <laughs> But your girl don't speak Spanish fluently and I've been trying to practice because I don't want to go into Miami and be like the only Cuban that doesn't talk Spanish like talk Spanish speak Spanish because That's kind of Gringa, you know what I mean? Like kind of gringa me. So I'm trying to like, you know, I wasn't I wasn't born What is what did he say? He's like I wasn't meant I don't even know what he said All I know I'll put the video in because I don't know exactly what he said But I'm thinking about Antonio Garza because he's a gay Period. Um, Latina. I didn't ask to be born Latina. No mas to be suerte. But he, yeah. Uh, and then after that, after going to Miami and Puerto Rico, your sis went to go see Pretty Much once again. She went back and she went to some shows. I went to Boston and New York, if y'all did not know. And man, did they put on a show. I, we literally pulled up to Boston, right? We literally are literally driving down the freaking street because my mom is going to park the car. And who the heck walks out of the bus? Take a guess. I'm going to give y'all 10 seconds to guess. Did you guess? Zion. Like, well, I was chill. I wasn't gonna be like, Zion, oh my god, what's up? Oh, I also got this necklace at the concert. It's just pretty much any. Okay, whatever. But back to the story. <laughs> um, yeah, so Zion pops out, the Canadian popped out of him, and he was like, Well, he didn't say anything. What the hell? Was <laughs> he, I mean, he said, Well, okay, we were driving. My mom always likes to embarrass me. Like, one day I'm really gonna put a freaking compilation of her embarrassing me in front of pretty much because it's a lot, okay? She's gonna be like, Oh my god, Zion. She rolls down the window and she's like, Zion. She's like, Oh hey. And then she was just like, It's just like, because he was walking into the bus. So my mom was like, Zion, Zion, Zion. And then he turned around and then, um, Gia, she was in the middle. Shout out, Gia. <laughs> Love you, kitty girls. But um, she was in the middle, so she gave him her phone, and she was like, can you take a picture? And so he took a picture with all of us. And uh, But did I add the most important part of it all? Um, he was shirtless, so. <laughs> that had me bugging. I think that's why I was quiet. Oh, I this is not the color for me. This is like my shade that I wear during the school year. Oh, that's fun. Anyway. But, um, I'll bronze it up, it'll be fine. But literally, this man walked out shirtless. I will, uh, I don't know, Abby, hello, how are you today? How nice to meet you. I'm Emily, what's your name? No, 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 but I was like, whoa. I was like, whoa, like, uh-uh. But it was fun and fresh, and then we were just waiting. And did I mention Boston was the, it was the hottest day. Literally, of course. Like, it was, like, 90-something degrees. Like, it was plus. Actually, I think it was 100 or something. Like, when I tell you I was standing there, you know that heat when you're, like, standing there? And then you're just sweating and you're not even doing anything? That's how hot it was. And we were standing out there for, like, eight hours. Like, it was not the best. But then after Boston, I really, guys, the amount of times I went to Boston and just went to concerts, I haven't even actually seen the city Boston. Like, I want to go and, like, actually see Boston because I'm never, like, you know. And then we went to the New York show, which was, like, so I think Boston was Sunday and then the New York show was Tuesday. So we went to the New York show. The New York show was really good. They brought out little TJ because, you know, you heard New York. So... Yeah, New York was fun. We were like, we got second row. Well, we got like barricade for both. I also, this is on topic, but like kind of off topic. If you guys want me to do like a concert video. Because I get asked so many freaking questions every day about like concerts. Like so many people want me to do, like just so many people ask me like, Emily, how do you do this? How do you get front row? How do you like whatever? And honestly, I kind of want to make this video because when I was younger, like when I was standing in Austin, like... I was like so confused. I was like, how do these girls get front row? Like, cause they don't tell you, obviously they're not gonna tell you. And like, you're probably not gonna know. So I kind of really want to film that type of video where maybe I'll like post a sticker on my Instagram, which y'all should go follow my Instagram. 
and then like you guys can ask me any questions you have about concerts and i can give you guys my advice because i have a lot to say and i think it'll be a fun video but i do have a lot of videos planned like for um this like upcoming school year and just like in general doing i literally have not guys i'm telling you i have not i told you i have not done makeup in so freaking long and i honestly actually i can't wait until i actually saw my senior pictures and i think they came out so freaking good like i actually look good for once in my life for once so i'm really honestly proud of that and i i wish i did i no i didn't i was gonna say i wish i filmed to get ready with me because maybe I'll do maybe I'll do one maybe I'll do a good uh, like picture day look to show you guys what I did to make my pictures look really good no flashback none of that because they came out really <laughs> I'm sorry they came out really good I'm probably gonna post them on Instagram like later when I get them but yeah I'm a senior guys I'm a senior <laughs> I'm about to wake them up oh that's another thing me and lauren are like starting this we're not starting it but like we always text each other this like i'm gonna insert the emojis right here okay this is like pets me off i'll insert the emojis here somewhere on the screen and it's basically like to copy like because we literally do that all the time like anything that we say we just do that too guys i can't wait till i can get laser eye surgery like you don't even know i hate hate contacts and glasses like they hurt like if you have your contacts on for like seven plus hours you are going to be dead so all y'all that have 20-20 vision you can suck my dick i'm not gonna say that because i'm trying to be more pg but like it's kind of hard because like <laughs> i have been driving though more oh my god you guys don't know that i got my freaking license okay that's the girl that oh that's where i was getting at so basically i got the whole reason i wanted a job especially was obviously to save money but i really want to get my own car by like december so that's your main reason why your girl has been working her little booty off because i really want a car oh i thought someone was at the door there's this app my uncle has and it's like it's called ring and you can like see when people are at your door and it's kind of scary but like <laughs> whatever i'm gonna try something new i have not used this i don't even know what it does it's the anastasia pro pencil base two i don't know what it is it's not even doing anything oh i see it just made a mark on my line did i just say made a mark on my line good lord i can't wait for senior year guys because like i'm t finally turning 18 like i wanted to turn 18 since I was birthed on March 22nd, 2002. So, and for my 18th birthday, I think I want to go to Miami like my friends or do something fun in the city. I don't know yet exactly what. We'll figure it out as it comes along. And I can, I can finally do so much. Like I finally can get my first tattoo, which I am definitely getting a red tattoo a red tattoo for my first tattoo and everyone's always like girl be careful because you can't laser remove it but like i'm the type of person that like i just don't care like okay it's on my body like i'm not gonna but also i know myself like i'm not gonna pick something like obviously i know myself but maybe i don't know maybe i won't like it when i'm older but i'm just the type of person that's like whatever like i just don't really care like i have this arrow on my hand which i never filmed it but i gave this self ugh, i self tattooed myself in like sophomore year so but everyone's like oh my god you're gonna regret that i'm like i don't really care like i look at it and i'm like okay like it's not the per best but like i'm not gonna be like it needs to get off my skin like i don't care it's like whatever okay what else do i do now i literally forgot how to do makeup it's kind of do you hear my stomach okay i'm gonna have story time so story time i hate bugs i hate them I wish that they would all disappear because I hate them. So I'm literally sitting. If I can, I actually have a video of me on live seeing a freaking bug, I think, in my camera roll. And if I do, it's being inserted now. Oh my god, best friend, best friend, best friend. <gasps> But I was literally. Oh, I forgot to bake. Shoot. So I moved into this new place, right? And I'm sitting on the toilet about to pee. So I look, please let me know. I literally look to my freaking, like, in front of me. And what's in front of me? This giant ass centipede. And when I say giant, I say giant. 
it was huge and it was running like i don't understand why bugs have to run too like why are they walking so damn fast like where are you going straight to the freaking garbage like you're running to your destiny i guess but it was literally running and i was like oh hell i'm on the toilet meanwhile this is all happening i'm on the damn toilet my mom is sleeping it's like 12 o'clock at night in the morning 12 a.m whatever um and it's dead ass running and i'm like oh hell Hell no, because it started coming closer to me, and I was like, if this thing comes up the toilet and I'm peeing on the toilet, it's gonna be a damn problem. So I was like, let me just, let me not. So I literally just get up and I just run out. Like, TMI, my pants were down. Like, I'm sorry, I'm not wasting time. This thing was running, like, it was running, like, it was about to win a marathon. Like, it was sprinting. So I was like, uh uh, <laughs> not today, not, not today. So I ran, and I didn't have pants on, and I ran out of the bathroom, and that's the end of my story time, and yeah. And then my mom killed it. But turns out, here's the tea, turns out as I was running out with my pants down, um, <laughs> I stepped on it. So technically I killed it, <laughs> but I didn't have to know that as I was running out. She didn't have to know. So yeah, I hate bugs, part two, 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 two. Literally, the video I'm about to film, like, the hair dyeing video, it's gonna be like hair dyeing part fucking a million, because I dye my hair, like... But it's just because I like my hair dark. Like, I love that, like, what, that look. Like, dark hair. Mm. Delicious. I wish I was born with that. This is my natural hair, actually. And this is, a, like, the texture of it, too. With no, like, water or gel or anything. This is how it looks. So, it's kind of ugly, but whatever. <laughs> I'm so annoyed. I really want to snatch my nose, guys. I really want to see how snatched I can make this nose. Because I want to, my nose to be, I want to have a rhinoplasty. That I think I messed up my rhinoplasty. My nose is kind of crooked. Great. Definitely filming when I have, because I go to private school, so I have to wear uniform. And, like, the last week of senior year, you're allowed to dress down. So I'm definitely going to film, like, a OOTD of what I wore, because that's iconic for me. Like, I've literally gone to private Oh, that's another thing. Like, I've gone to private school my whole entire I'm scratching my armpit, deal with it. Um, I went to private school my whole entire life. So this is literally gonna be the first time ever, like when I go to college, of me going to school without a uniform. So I'm kinda shocked. I'm kinda shocked. Aww. That's what I try to be when I try to be cool. Just doesn't work. I'm going to see it. see Breezy on September 21st. And I'm so excited because i love him i love that man and me and lauren are going to connecticut for that concert and it's gonna be really freaking awesome so you know your girl might lose her mind a little and i really am trying to go see Lil mosey because that is my baby daddy i love him shut up like oh he's <laughs> His songs just make me feel some type of way. They just do. Like, I love him. Like, literally, shut up. If I met him, because I was going to get me angry, I would told Lauren, I will literally poop my pants. Like, it's going to happen. Like, that's just not, that's not, no. Let's just not put Emily in that predicament. So, I wanted to do a little update on the nail situation. That nail video has 12,000 views. Y'all are crazy. Okay. That nail video has 12,000 views. That's in freaking insane. I almost peed my pants. I say about the nail video was, I got a lot of comments on that video asking me a whole bunch of stuff like are they flimsy are they like what is the deal guys they are like exactly like acrylic nails like they are not flimsy the tips are exactly ow why would i do that they are exactly like how you would get regular acrylics now they are not acrylics because they're just the the plastic part but they look like acrylics like if anyone saw you they're gonna be like oh you're acrylics like mm -hmm, mm -hmm. you know that Thank you to whoever subscribed. I promise I'm gonna be a good like YouTuber and like upload as much as I can. Like I'm trying to do a video every week, okay? But it's kind of hard and kind of stressful when you have school, okay? It's hard, but I'm gonna try because like I clicked, like I have, I literally didn't even check my channel for a good month. I have to say, and that's kind of sad because I love my channel, but. I didn't click on it for like a month and I came back and I gained like 60 to put how much is that well how many I'm at right now but I think I gained like 60 which is insane so thank you so freaking much so if you haven't subscribed already subscribe because there's more content coming and turn on the little bell button so you get in your debate every day of a little video like you know the vibes show you all they look if it focuses 
pretty freaking real and they're always close to my eyeball. Wow, Emily, it's hot. It's absolutely insane when someone came up to me and was like, I know who you are. Like, that's crazy. And like, oh, I just love the fact that like I can do these videos. And like, if it put a smile on your face watching, I'm glad because that's literally all I want to do. So yeah, and like I'm going to college for like media and like communications and all that type of stuff. So that's literally what I want to do for the rest of my life. Because YouTube, honestly, people say what they want to say, but YouTube helped me through some of my hardest times. I have to say, like, watching people, just even watching tutorials, like, just to get your mind off, like, the stress of life. It just helps, so. And I used to get made fun of it for, like, people who think that, like, oh, she probably never was bullied, or, like, I don't really know. Like, you don't, you don't know anyone's story, but, like, I, like, being younger, I remember people just didn't get it. Like, I always used to just vibe by myself, because, like, no one understood, like... You know, just no one, and I feel like still no one really gets how I feel about it, so. That's just me. So, let's do a little, um, what is it called? Positive talk, uplifting talk, little reminder of the day to do what you want to do and don't let anyone try to make you feel bad about what you love because you know what? It could take you somewhere far and that's on period. I'm gonna go put my lip gloss on now. <laughs> anyway, guys, this is the finished look. I'm really shook that, again, I haven't seen myself in makeup in so long. But I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like, comment, subscribe. Do whatever you want to do. Don't forget to throw it back like a mother freaking pro man. I haven't said it in so long. And I will see you guys in my next video, probably with darker hair. So, and don't forget to like this video and subscribe and all of that. Because, again, as you guys, if you watch this whole video, you know that there's content coming. So, toodles.